can't when I imagine how this is going to look, and I you know I come down 41 to go to work. Am I going to be in my car in a couple of years jockeying for position with a big old BRT articulating in the middle, uh, or does it have its own special lane? Well, well, one of the, one of the key points that we found out when we started looking at uh, some of the projections and some of the other areas where. Uh, either bus rapid transit or light rail transit or even heavy rail transit, one of the key elements that was the portion of what we call a fixed guideway, uh, that means that these vehicles will be running in a dedicated lane, a fixed guideway. In this case with BRT, it would be a bus lane, or they would be sharing a lane in the HOV, but it still would be separated, or the managed lanes, but it would still be separated from the general purpose traffic that's going up and down 41. So if you were on US 41 at the time, you would uh, more, more likely it would be bus lanes in the median of US 41. That way they don't, uh, uh, there's no issues interacting with driveways and things like that. And there would be particular areas where uh, you could cross like you would any other uh, median divided highway. So uh, hopefully uh, the buses, the folks who would be using uh, the BRT would be moving along at, at a speed certainly competitive or hopefully quicker uh, than at least in the peak hour of the peak hour traffic. One of the key things we, we also looked at in 41, uh, looked at a couple of different opportunities of how we deal challenges of how we deal with, with the busy intersections. Uh, some of the intersections, well, we will grade separate. In other words, the bus fixed guideway, the bus lane will either uh, fly over or tunnel under particular intersections. Uh, so there's no disruption to the vehicle traffic as well as the timing of the of the BRT traffic. Uh, others will we, we will uh, what we call signal preemption. In other words, as the BRT vehicle approaches a particular intersection, the signal would recognize that that BRT bus is coming, and the timing would change to allow the bus to to travel basically straight through. Uh, which would also benefit the traffic running in those general purpose lanes too, because <laughs> they're running right beside it. So, right. so, uh, but, but some of the busier intersection we would grade separate. I think uh, depending on what the final alignment is, we're looking at uh, 10 to 12 of the inter major intersections on US 41 to be grade separated. Uh, the others will be signal preempted, and even areas where you have medium breaks. Uh, where people would need to cross at certain areas non-signalized, those would also have some type of signal system so that somebody wanting to cross, cross the, the, the bus fixed guideway would know a signal that a bus is either coming or not right. coming. Oh, yeah. And so all that's done in a very, you know, very safe and uh, signalized manner. Gotcha. So, Faye, how quick are we going to see these buses?